The word complement in the number system means the difference of the number from the highest number of that digit. This definition can be applied to various number systems and they are named differently as well. But in general, if a number has base of n, then that is known as n-1's complement. However, if we add 1 with that value, then we will get us n's complement. For example, let us start with decimal number because we are mostly familiar with that number system. Let us take a number 25. The complement can be found out in two ways and since it has a base of 10, which will be called as 10 minus 1, that is 9's complement. The method is to subtract the number from highest number of that digit. The number here is 25. It is two digits decimal number. 99 is the highest two digit decimal number. Hence, the number has to be subtracted from 99. So, we get 99 minus 25, that is 74. And this is 9's complement of 25. Now, if we add 1 with 74, we will get 75, which is 10's complement of 25. Now, come to a binary number, which is our main topic for discussion. It has only two digits, 0 and 1. And hence, the name is binary. It has a base of 2. So, if we subtract it from the highest number of that digit, then we get 2 minus 1, that is 1's complement. If 1 is added with that, then we will get 2's complement. However, luckily for us, there is another method of finding 1's complement. We do not have to remember all those steps to find out 1's and 2's complement. But a simple trick will do the job. Here, just we have to replace 1 by 0 and 0 by 1 to find out 1's complement. Adding 1 with that result will give us 2's complement. For 0, 1, 0, 0, we will have 1's complement just by replacing 1 by 0 and 0 by 1. And this will give the result 1, 0, 1, 1. Adding 1 with that result will give us 1, 0, 1, 1 plus 1. That is 1, 1, 0, 0. And this is 2's complement of 0, 1, 0, 0. So, in both methods, we see that we have found out the same result and hence both methods are correct and one can use any one of them according to its convenience.